So, got a uh, got an old uh, Honda 200S motor, if you believe here. Um, she's been on uh, on the shelf for a minute. I don't have a don't have a bike to uh, to, uh, to test her in, but uh, to show you uh, she runs. So I figured uh, figured I'd go ahead and hit up a uh, compression test. So you can see, uh, see she's got real nice, good compression. But, uh, but yeah, a little disclaimer here. Um, it has a decompression valve for a reason. Um, this old girl's got uh, got pretty stinking uh, tough compression on them, and it will about yank your arm out of socket if you pull it without decompressing so I'm gonna try to keep my arm and my shoulder intact to my body with uh, with pulling on this thing um, without the decompression lever lever on but, uh, but yeah now let's uh, let's get to the uh, the arm pulling out of socket here I don't know if you can see it very well here. I've got my old, old compression tester here. But uh, yeah, you can see you've got the needle on zero. Um, see, I'm just kind of laying it down here. Because uh, hopefully I don't pull her off the table. So I'm going to put a real steady hand on it somewhere because it's kind of awkward. Some pressure and see if I can can pull on this a little. Oh. Okay. So arm still intact. I'm gonna show you here what it looks like. We got just a titch over the 140 mark. Um, that's pretty stinking good compression. You put a little bit of put a little bit of fuel to this thing. Maybe add some spark to the mix. You got a running engine. So yeah. Uh, hopefully, hopefully you can see that there. I know it's any glare on the light or anything like that, hopefully it's focusing, but yeah. Old girl's got some got some good compression to her. It's ready to be brought back to life in another bike. And uh, ride away and have some fun. <laughs> 